God knows about love, and He knows about sex. Today we're going to talk about save sex. I hope you caught that. I didn't say safe sex. It's S-A-V-E, save sex. Sex pretty much surrounds you everywhere. Yeah, if a guy goes around having sex a bunch of times, he's cool. They say if you practice safe sex, you won't get pregnant, and you won't get a sexually transmitted disease but they're wrong. We've all heard horror stories about teenage pregnancies, AIDS, and all that, but most of you won't be scared into saving sex. Now, whoever I marry, I'm gonna have to sit down and tell them, okay, look, I've already had sex, that if I could go back, I wouldn't have sex. For a lot of you, safety has never been your main concern. I mean, you're bungee jumping off bridges, you're driving 90 miles per hour to school, excitement is more important than safety. Oh, it might be fun. That was just my goal in life, just to have sex. Sex is not a bad thing. No way. It's a very, very good thing. Grab your Bible, turn to the Song of Solomon. It's the most romantic, the sexiest, the most thrilling love poem you'll ever see. When like half your friends aren't virgin, it puts a lot of like pressure and stress on you. Why aren't you having sex? Just imagine that Bill Gates gives a 14 year old a check for a thousand dollars. And that's the way it is with sex. Why do girls give in to guys? And second, what are three reasons not to have sex? Virginity. Well, we had the chance to go on this peer to retreat. There are a growing number of young people willing to make a stand. Some older girls were telling us how helpful it was to their lives and it influenced their way of thinking. Say no to premarital sex. We all signed a pledge to stay sexually pure. We were held accountable from all our friends around us. And our parents signed it with us. Draw your boundary lines now. Don't wait until you're embracing in some parked car. Don't see how far you can go without sinning. Our church gave us purity rings. I've learned that I want to save myself for that special person in my life. It's a lot easier to stick to my commitment knowing my friends have already made the same commitment. They're there for your accountability. It's easy to start thinking that Christians don't want to have any fun, but Christians have a blast. We just want to honor God with our sexuality. Sexual.